What if your love song suddenly went from a duet to a solo? Because one of you was no longer there to sing it. Writer Jamie Anderson said that grief is just love with no place to go. But could sharing that grief with others that know it give our love direction again? We've done there's, this before when we did a like new person and there them. were four of us that lost our spouses to suicide. So and so when they get us and it's suicide, 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 yeah. suicide, suicide, oh shit, we can't sit by you. We can't sit by you. <laughs> and it changes you and it's hard to find the new you. And so it's nice to have somebody else to kind of guide you through that. Because you don't realize how much it changes you. But that it's okay that that's happening. You fight it And though. that it's okay to laugh and it's okay to cry. What would you like other people to know that would, would have made it easier? Or how can they, they not make it worse? Exactly. Somebody asked me one time just shortly after my husband had died how I like to sing life. I would like people to talk of my husband more yes. and say his name mm -hmm. yes. because it's like they're scared to bring up his name because then they think, oh, now I'm making her remember it. It's like, duh, I never forget it. You know, he's with me 24-7 exactly. every day of my life. I'd like to hear some stories because that just helps me know that other people love him too. My grandkids like it because it brings them out and then they can tell their stories about, yeah, I remember when he was giving me a piggyback ride, he fell on me. <laughs> As we've traveled the United States and we've talked to people about their relationships, the most important things to them weren't the big things. It was the little things that were done around the house or notes that were left. What are the little things that you miss? Phone call at lunch. Probably the little notes. I still have one in his cookbook where he had written that I went for a run, I took Sophie with me, that was the dog. Uh, I've just never taken that out of the cookbook. Okay, here's the flip side of that question. Uh -oh. There's also little things that people do that drive you absolutely crazy. <laughs> you love them anyway, those are those little things you learn to accept. What's the little, what's the little things that drove you crazy? You probably miss them now. You sit here and watch Survivor with me. I said, I don't like Survivor. <laughs> and then after he left, I sat there and I said, first thing, one of the first things I did was turn on Survivor. <laughs> he would always have to pepper his food and he would get it on the counter. And one day I pointed it out to him that, you know, do you really have to miss your plate that much? The next morning I got up to the whole counter was full of pepper. <laughs> I didn't ever say it again. <laughs> Do you ever find people telling you you need to move on? Oh, yes. yeah. Yeah. And how would you like to say to those people? Moving forward and moving on. It is two different things. Again, this is forgive us if we transgress. This is a personal question. Um, but if this device was capable of getting a short message across to the oh. other side, what, what would you say? What the hell? <laughs> my husband took his life, so my question would be why? And I'd still give him a hug and say, You get a chance to ask that question. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But someday we will again. You've had to find ways now that life changed of making yourselves happy. What do you do? Where, where, do, you, where do you find that place again? Well, through this group, three of us, Deb, Sheila, and myself, have developed a really close friendship. Since we were all at the same place, it's easy for us to, to bond. We've become almost like three sisters. And this is a family. We call this it family. Is a family. It is. It is. I hate what brought us together, but I love that we are together. Yes, yes. 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 You know, life is different, but life is still good. Mm -hmm. But, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thanks for watching, and if you want some more love in your life, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Where's that going to be? Should I point at it? It's on YouTube.